the first of three bouts on pay-per-view tonight in which we can say somebody's O has got to go. And we are getting things started with strawweight action. The best in the business. Referee Big John McCarthy calls for the bell, and we are underway. Thug Rose, Nama Yunus with the red tape around her gloves. Tisha Torres with the blue tape around her gloves. Both very highly touted prospects. And both meeting at this stage of their careers. Torres comes in, lands a couple of right hands. Final 10 seconds of the second round. Again, at close quarters, Nama Yunus and Torres, and there Torres is on her back. Well, we should watch this fight then. Oh, oh, nice combination nice. by Torres, but a good counter right by Nama Yunus. For your winner by unanimous decision, and still undefeated, the Tiny Tornado! Let's talk about this next fight. It's a rematch with Tisha Torres. That happened over three years ago. Is there anything that you can take away from that experience that will help you in the rematch? Yeah, um, patience, patience, patience. Mm. Uh, that's just like the, the motto of like Rose. So that's kind of what I've learned is that um, I have to use my mind more than just my like physical aggression to, to beat Tisha. The rematch of a fight three years ago, which Tisa Torres earned the victory. Here we go! Rose Nama Yunus, she is in the black trunks. Tisha Torres in the white trunks. The magnitude of this matchup. Coming off the historic season 20 of The Ultimate Fighter. Those good kicks behind it. Oh, excellent kick there by Torres, though. Well, she's wild. I mean, she's wild by nature in a lot of ways. Trevor Whitman said, no kicks for a while. Let the takedown present itself. There's a good connection by Nami Yunus. Up the middle. Good right hand counter by Rose. Every day just trying to improve. Big swing and a miss. Oh, she tagged her. Side of that Stiff time. left hand there. Two minutes in. Oh, she tagged her again. Yep. And then she tags her again. Very nice. Rose can't know she's coming. Here's a nice kick by Rose. Oh, slip. Oh, shit. Nice kick and a good left hand. Tremendous shape. She fights like this all the time. Oh, good left on a shot by Rose Nami Yunus. Oh, nice left kick by Rose. Big exchange late in this round. Wow. Unleash. I'm in his black belt in Taekwondo and in karate. Now I'm in trying to establish that jab counter by Torres. Still anybody's fight. Classic Muay Thai attack. Close the knee. Flying knee attempt. Round kick. Looking for that jab, but good right hand and with the takedown. Very nicely done. Once again, they go the decision. Thug Rose. It's 1-1, one, one. Nama Yunus wins in the octagon. Here we go, Co-Main Event. The ability to move just out of range and come back in and counter. Good leg kick by Kovalkiewicz. Well, that division was so wide open, there just wasn't a lot of experienced fighters there. And when you, there's a nice counter right hand by Rose. Extremely talented. Good footwork and movement by Rose. There's a nice left hand by Rose. Over oh, the top. A nice right hand right on, on cue. 
with Trevor Whitman, her coach, has always been a very highly respected striking coach. Yeah. There's a nice right hand. Rose still growing, still learning, but Good she leg feels kick. like she's on a whole oh. other level, Joe. She goes high with that kick. You can't try to bite down and swing with Kovalkiewicz. Oh, she caught her with a beautiful counter there. They work nice in the knee clinch. in the clinch. And knees by Carolina. Beautiful knees. Carolina. Rose connects with a couple punches. If I was in Carolina's corner, I'd be calling for her. Right there. There it is again. These are nasty elbows and knees in the clinch. Nama Yunus trying to put oh, Kovalkiewicz down. Elbow. Beautiful one-two by Rose. Hands down for Carolina Trying to continuously engage. Right hand over the top by Carolina. Nice front kick by Rose. And a and nice right hand. Again with the Again, clinch in the knees. Nasty clinch and knees to the body. Kovalkiewicz was defeated, was in an amateur fight. Oh. Again, you can tell there's a lot of power behind him. Rose with a jumping knee. And a jab. We'll see in five minutes or less. Nama Yunus had closed the distance. Again, his knees to the body. But that's one of the things that we had talked about coming in this fight is how strong she is. Crazy exchanges here. Beautiful leg kick by Rose. Yep. Good counter right hand there by Rose. Nice right hand from Nama Yunus, yeah. Look at Rose looking for the takedown. Watch the up kick. Right there. there. And again. And again. Wild exchange at the bell. They go the distance. For the winner by split decision, Carolina Kovalkiewicz. And again, Watterson back to the well, attacking that lead knee of Nami Yunus. Oh, big right hand for Thug Rose. Nice right hand by Watterson. Oh, Nami Yunus with a huge head kick. Watterson recovered quickly. She's eating a lot of ground and pound here, though. Rose is letting her go, letting her have it. Watterson trying so hard to stay in this fight. Fight hand, there's the tap. Good, Rose Nama Yunus. Um, I feel like I can go all the way to the belt and hold it for a while. So, um, Joanna or whoever is going to win that fight, I'm coming for you. Be careful. Um, it's every, like, you know, every fighter is different. Every... Um, fight is different every training camp. I've trained my entire life for this moment. So, and and at the end of the day, it's just a moment in my life. So, um, really, what I've learned from that fight is uh, I've just gotten better mentally. Like I've overcome some demons in my past, and uh, you know, I'm just every day I wake up, I'm a I'm a fucking champion. So. Hey, listen to your right. fans. You didn't want to do media. You didn't want to do extra media. How you want to be a champion and deal with all of the the things? You know what? You are not stronger mentally. You are mentally unstable, and you are broken already, and I will break you in the fight. Did you enjoy the open workout yesterday? You looking forward yes. to fight night? This is what I wanted. You know, I wanted to be in the belly of the beast. I wanted to be as scary as possible. I wanted to fight Joanna at her best, where she wanted to, and this is what I want, and this is where I'm at. This, this is what I'm expecting, but I think this press conference is a little bit too much, and after the uh, second phase of... She going, she, she's going to be more dressing out about my, our fight on Saturday. So I think you cannot be the champion because you just can't do this. You can't deal with the media. You cannot deal with the pressure. It's too much for you. Introducing the challenger, Rose Namayunas! Official win! your thoughts on this intense stare down this fight and what tomorrow night means to you you keep talking to her what are you saying to her 
I'm just saying of Lord's Prayer. Boogie Woman is coming tomorrow, and she doesn't know what's coming. And I have a surprise for you guys. Don't blink tomorrow. Five rounds if needed to determine the UFC strawweight champion. She's seeing everything. Oh. The ability to counter just as well as she fights going forward. Comfortable in a kickboxing situation. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Down for Nama Yunus. This is where Rose has the advantage. Rose this moves is where Rose has the advantage. Rose has the advantage on the ground and in the clinch here. Last four defenses for Young Jay check as she eats she another left hand. Again. She tagged her with the right that time. Yep. But you gotta be careful hanging out in the pocket against Young Jacek. Well, Rose. Oh! oh! Another knockdown! Oh! Rose Nama Yunus oh! trying to close the show! She was doing a great job of fading. That is it! It's over! Oh! Rose Nama Yunus! Rose! Rose! First round, declaring the winner by knockout, Pog Rose Namayuna! Support here in New York, and we are underway. Remarkable. Yeah, she gets better every time you see it. She just landed a one two right there. She knows when she's out of trouble. The round this fight has already lasted longer than the first meeting. Excellent footwork and movement by both of them. Very nice leg kick there by Joanna. Oh, Rose with the right hand. Oh, another one, and then slides out of the way. After a stance change, she changed her stance and then attacked. Nama Yunus continues to keep that right hand oh. high. It's hard to get the right going, and so far she hasn't. Oh! oh. Big left for Young Jay check. All right, round two here, Nama Yunus and Young Jay check. Jimmy, oh. you heard? Well, we'll hold that thought for a second after the Nama Yunus combination. Feeling like Keon Jacek has to cover more distance. Now that patented jab lands. It's a great message to send to someone who's usually the psychological bully. Hey, right. dropping my hands. I'm ready for you. I'm not afraid. Oh, he clipped her to the left. And beautiful movement. Oh. Just over two minutes here, round two. Oh. Stuck her there. Referee saying no. Oh, she clipped it with the left. This is crazy. It's, it's taking care of that left hook and it's been landing all night. I'm sure she was weakened by the weight cut, but this, there's more. There's more going on here. She's dealing with a girl who's emerging. There's a lot of mutual respect going on here. Oh, she clipped her. Karolina Kivalkovic as a top talent. Some of the best of the best in 135. Ooh, right hand over the top. She's landing a nice head kick that was partially blocked and a right hand behind it. Oh, back fist. 68 to 42, a lot of those leg kicks, but... Oh, good kick to the body there. Well, they certainly got enough of that last fight. Good right hand. Oh, oh that was a hard one. Oh, there was a good right hand by Rose. Oh, yep. She just ate that leg kick and wobble, and she ate another one there. Much more stationary target than yes. she was in the first oh, the two rounds. The right hand there. It's hard to then check. It's hard to then lift that leg off the ground when you're that low and having to slide side to side. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, those people are idiots. Oh! oh! One of the more significant left hands from Nama Yunus in the fight. Young Jake Check able to eat it. This compromise in that right eye. Nice Ooh. jab. Or... Nama Yunus with some good hands in this fifth and final round. Oh, beautiful jab. Standing her ground and 
throwing a bit oh. more in this round. Oh! Yeah, man, Lauren's having problems with that nose. nose right now. Yeah. Look at it. It's the fifth and final round. She can dig in. Rose Namajunas has never oh, been knocked out. Cut. And 11 pro fights coming in. Wonder. I mean, she's had trouble with her accuracy in her two fights. She's not trying to slide out and set it up with angles. She's throwing heavy punches. Both of these ladies looking extremely sharp. Oh, oh she not dug into that, that right hand. hand. Beautiful. And that she's the one who's slipping and moving better. Much better head movement. Joanna's just sort of throwing and ducking her head down. The takedown. Just to the end. So the rematch goes the distance. For decision. All three judges score this contest 49 46 for the winner by unanimous decision. Thug Rose Namayuna. Okay, Jessica Rose, you know exactly what I expect. I want you to fight hard and easy to fight clean. Jessica Andrade is in yellow. Rose Namajunas in the black and gold befitting a champion. Moving quick. Oh, nice right hand by Rose. She's just sticking her. Powerful fighter. Rose seems a lot quicker than Jessica. She's already marking her up, John. Right, yeah, he's not at all in good shape for Andrade. Less than already. a minute in. Oh, and Andrade got caught on the way in now. Yep. Counter left hook is one of Rose's best punches. Kicks, you gotta see. Oh, man. She's oh. getting tagged, though. It's not enough. She's gotta be first. She can't be waiting on Rose. See the fakes. Footwork, in and out, jab. No matter what, if Andrade tries to lift and slam Rose, if you grab a hold of that Kimura. That big takedown. That Kimura does not work in Andrade. Nama Yunus wrestled at the Milwaukee High School, but she gives Tony Basili a lot of credit for taking her jujitsu to the next level. The jab in the right hand. Oh, oh Andrade gets stunned. Wow, oh, Nama Yunus. Yep, Nama Yunus is looking like an absolute savage right now. So far, it's been a mixed martial arts display. And a straight right hand from Andrade seemed to get Nama Yunus' attention. She's behind her because she's so much faster. Round one of Andrade versus Namajunas right. went to Andrade. Well. See that counter hook is a thing of beauty, the way she throws it. She steps outside oh, and then that throws left it. Hook, that left hook was close for Andrade. That one right there. Have new wrinkles, take her game to the next level, and she appears to have done that. They want her to keep fighting like this. Nice counter hook again. That's her best punch, Rose. She's throwing that little hook from her hip. She's got to get her hands up. Just a piston right in your face. And when Nama Yunus has retreated, she has tried to catch Andrade with a power shot on the way in. See how she circles her, fires the punch into the way that she circles in rows. So she's leading the dance by circling Andrade into the power. As we've seen, Jessica does have one punch knockout power. Hopefully, you inflict more damage than the taller person on your way in. It's looking tough for Andrade from the outside. She's got to keep landing those leg kicks to wear down rows. Otherwise, it's gonna be long. Looking on the problem, which is the hands. Nope, can't lift there. She'll still oh, get the ball. Oh, oh she slammed her right out. Now you can't. She knocked her out. Jessica Andrade, the UFC strawweight champion. The former UFC strawweight champion and. Uh, the young woman who will be returning to action on July 11th, UFC 251. One of the most anticipated fights on that card, Rose Namajunas against Jessica Andrade too. And she's back. Rose is back. It's been over seven months since we last talked to her, and it's great to talk to her again. Rose, how are you? I'm good. Uh, yeah, time flies, huh? I love this sport, you know. There's definitely, there's always things to to gripe and complain about, but um, this is what I love to do, man. I'm a martial artist, and... Uh, I'm, you know, I'm just pretty much hitting my prime right now. So it's just like everything's like all of a sudden coming together. It seemed like everything was kind of falling apart, but now it's uh, sometimes you got to, sometimes things got to crumble down before you can put it back yeah. together again, you know?
I still can't get over how good you looked in that first round. Like I, I still feel like, and correct me if you feel otherwise, that might've been like your best round. Are you confident you can get back to that point? Um, based on my training and based on just my mentality and where everything is kind of led up to this point, it's definitely the makings for a spectacular performance. Okay. And um, maybe I would say, you know, hopefully the best, the best performance yet. I mean, my, my skill and my abilities and, and even just the control over my, myself has been the best it's ever been this whole training camp. So yeah, I'm looking forward to performing. As I said before, she's got to do the same thing here. Use the footwork. And I was saying that Andrade is certainly moving it all over the place right now. Time runs out. Tenet, only in theaters Wednesday, August 12th. Picked her up and we all know what happened and how it ended. You know, you know, you might say, oh, that was a fluke. But it, it wasn't a fluke. She was trying to fight her, box her way into the clinch. And Ooh. then to slam her. But she's looking good here. Nama Yunus looking slick on the feet, lands the jab there. She just trains with an amazing team right, in the business. Of course, as you said, Chico Camus. Yep. And Greg Nelson as well. I mean, that's an all-star corner right there. She has trained extensively with Valentina Shevchenko. I mean, you see, oh, beautiful left hook landed there. This is certainly an improved approach by Andrade. And a lot of it is stemming from the head movement. right for Nama Yunus. And that jab keeping Andraj at bay. Any striking coach out there would be proud to say that that's their student. Andraj a little busted up in the nose area. We know Andraj wants to clinch, take a tight clinch, and drive a knee right up the midsection. Body movement from Andraj here early. Oh, on the countdown show, she had like a, I don't know what you guys would call it. <laughs> Listen, it's been a long time since I've played with hula hoops, okay? It's all right. You guys would say. <laughs> Shot from Andrade, oh. eats a knee for her troubles. For Rose Nama Yunus. Rose Song. The first fight was fantastic. They both learned from it. Ooh, just miss with that. Certainly when you jump in the air and throw it. Yeah, she's so cool in there, you know. She's an absolute professional. She really wants to be there tonight. Big body shot by Andrade, though. Oh. Oh. And a nice one, two in return. Blue corner of Thug Rose. Nami Yunus, there's the knee. Sting. Bam. Just like that. Sting. From distance. Just like that. For all cornermen and coaches out there, that's how you want it to be. You know, positive reinforcement, not stressing out and screaming and going crazy, you know. Nice one-two from Nama Yunus. Slipping the jab and then coming back with two three-punch combinations. But no, hold your ground, stay there, control the center. Dictate the pace, use the length, pick her apart. Here in round three, this fight's moving quickly, man. Ah, it's incredible. Andrade has attempted two takedowns, has not been able to ground Nama Yunus as yet. Strong base, whatever. Strong base, bang, and just touch him. Down the middle, down, just like that, Rose. Just like that. Little short touches, grab a little strong arm. Drudge hits hard. You start to see a bit of damage Ooh. in the face of Rose. Little wobble there for a second. Comes back with a flying knee. Oh, there it is. One, two, perfect. Oh, oh yeah. Cross the one minute mark now. Starting to feel the damage. Andrade hits so hard. Oh, oh heavy job. Oh, what an outstanding showcase for these two oh, athletes. Man. And the strawweight division, deepest division in women's MMA and a standing ovation. Scores it. 29-28 for the winner by split decision. Thug Rose number you!